what it means to be a technology leader comes down to focusing on the present while keeping your eyes also on the future. You have to make life easy for your customers. Is someone who has uh, courage, it takes courage to innovate, to move into the unknown. We are right now in the Aarhus uh, Vestas office. This is my workplace. Vestas put its first wind turbine in the ground in 1979. And therefore, as an industry, we've been on a 45-year journey since then. The turbines that we design are hugely complex uh, pieces of equipment and therefore being able to test and validate the designs before they go into service with our customers is critical to ensuring that they are reliable and perform as expected when in operation. We are here in the basement now. Here's where we perform some of our verification activities. OK up there, it's already in full swing. We have many different components that we test here, different test types. We do qualification tests and then tests beyond that. Vestas is a pioneer and the first company to really harvest uh, data and to build this empirical foundation. We produce wind turbines, but we enhance these wind turbines so we make better innovations, better performance, better value through data. And that is, that is the key of what uh, Vestas is doing. Can I use my hands? We've developed a technology so that you can take the blade at end of life and then you can more or less disintegrate it into each individual material and then each individual material you can recycle. I'm sitting with a piece of glass fiber that actually has been in the blade and then we've recycled the materials in the blade and now this is one of these pieces that are left. Well, we also know that we, uh, that we need to do more. It's about finding other ways of producing the steel to ensure that you don't emit as much as CO2 in the production process and keep driving the decarbonization of our steel throughout our turbines. We ourselves are looking into how Vestas itself can be sustainable. So how can our wind power plants be sustainable? How is it the entire value chain is sustainable? So it has gone from being something that we're a part of to you know us taking it on ourselves and saying, how can we do it better?